Alrighty guys, welcome back to Star Wars Review. Today I'm reviewing uh, Star Wars The High Republic Adventures Issue 5 Showdown on the Junk Moon, which is written by uh, Daniel Jose Older, which had art by uh, Harvey Talabea with um, Pau Rodericks and Manuel Bracci. It was released on June 16, 2021. So yeah, it was a solid issue. Um, Wraps up some plot lines uh, and teases uh, what's to come in the next arc and you know, other High Republic stories, definitely Daniel has the older upcoming uh, middle grade novel, Race to Crash Point Tower, which, um, I, I really like where it seems like, uh, the characters will be going in those stories, definitely, uh, Zine and Crix, which I'll get into that more, uh, later, but, um, yeah, uh, issue, um, there was some weird, I don't know, pacing, I don't know, there's one moment in the issue which, I really don't understand fully what's going on, um, so, and it doesn't, you know, say anything in the, um, issue at the end with what happened or what, so it's kind of weird, I'll talk about that in a moment, but, yeah, uh, you know, obviously I could just be stupid, but, uh, I just don't really fully understand what's going on, but, um, yeah, you know, other than that, I thought it was a solid issue, um, so yeah, anyways, the art, uh, it says there's two other artists on this issue. I didn't notice any huge changes in the art in between pages. So I, you know, pretty much, you know, it seems exactly the same. I'm no art expert, so, you know, I'm probably just missing it. But, uh, yeah, I'm, you know, fine. I li- have, uh, liked the art so far in this series, so, yeah. Anyways, I'll jump into the breakdown now, which the issue starts with, um, Crix on, uh, Quintixie chasing, uh, the junk maven from the last issue, but, uh, he sees a, uh, Jedi vector fly down, and so he shoots at it, but then he realizes it's Zine in it, uh, but then, uh, it cuts to, uh, Marky on Row ordering, uh, the Nihil to, uh, kill the, uh, junk mavens, but, uh, then the, uh, Jedi Padawans arrives, and arrive and, you know, start trying to look for Zine, but they find the, uh, the Nihil attacking the Junk Mavens, and so they, you know, they start to help, uh, but then, you know, they see the cloud of smoke, uh, you know, in the distance, and it's coming from where, uh, Zine's signal is, so, uh, Lula, uh, goes towards the smoke while the other Padawans stay to help the, uh, Junk Mavens, uh, but then we see, uh, Crix block up, uh, to Zine, uh, he was uh, angry at him for uh, shooting her down, but you know he tries to uh, explain himself, but you know stumbles over his words, uh, which he then gets a call from uh, seemingly Marky Monroe, telling him to arrive at some uh, coordinates, and so he runs off. But uh, Zine gets out of the Jedi uh, vector, you know, yelling at him to wait. But then it cuts to uh, Yoda and the other uh, Jedi masters who've uh, now arrived on Quintixie. Uh, and, you know, they hear the battle off in the distance, so they head towards it, but, uh, they run into the, uh, Elder Tromac, who, uh, despite not liking the Jedi, helps them out by, uh, allowing them to ride the, um, uh, creature he has, and, you know, he had to escape from Nile, but, uh, then we see, uh, him and Yoda talking, uh, and, you know, uh, he, um, tells Yoda, about an artifact he uh, knows the location of, and Yoda asks if it's the uh, purple artifact we uh, you know, we saw uh, Yoda find on the Nihil ship in issue one, which, um, you know, Tromac says, you know, it's the same, so he tells him where he can, uh, you know, find it, and then he can take take him, Yoda, to, to uh, it, which Yoda says he'll uh, consider it. Uh, but then we see the, uh, Padawans fighting, and a, uh, Savrip comes out and attacks, which is the, uh, one, uh, Dejeric piece, uh, which was originally seen in, uh, New Hope, so it's, it's cool, I, I, I like when you see the, uh, Dejeric pieces and, um, you know, actually out there in, you know, in the actual Star Wars world, and not as a, a game, uh, hologram piece thingy, but, uh, yeah, uh, but then we see, uh, Lula catch up, uh, to Zine's ship, and, you know, she sees, uh, her running, uh, way off in the distance, so she runs after her, 
which we then see the uh, Jedi Masters uh, catch up with the Padawans who tell them that uh, Lula went to go help Zine and that, you know, to uh, go help her and, you know, because they uh, got everything dealt with uh, there. But um, then we see uh, Zine confront Crix who uh, starts to talk, but uh, Zine starts using the force on him. I think it was maybe force choke. Uh, they didn't have him, like, you know, reacting to it in a way, uh, obviously, because it's a, you know, a youth uh, comic series. But, uh, yeah, um, but then, you know, uh, Lula uh, gets there and, you know, stops Zine from uh, doing that and, you know, tells her, you know, that's not not the uh, their way. Uh, but then we see them get, a, you know, surprised uh, because Mark Yonroe and the Nihil arrive and, you know, they pick up Crix and start to fly away. Uh, we see Zine pick up uh, Crix's blaster he left there and, you know, fire it, but I didn't do anything. But uh, then the Jedi Masters arrive and, you know, they all start using the force on the uh, ship, but, you know, they're not uh, successful in stopping it uh, because uh, the big uh, spider ship comes and picks uh, them up and, you know, they jump to hyperspace and leave. Uh, but then uh, some time passes and we see uh, Jedi back on Ord Mantel. We see uh, Padawans uh, reunite. But uh, then the uh, Jedi Masters are talking, you know, wondering where Yoda went off to, which we then see him and Elder Tromac heading to the place where the artifact is. Uh, but, you know, they run into some uh, trouble, some other ships attacking them. And uh, Yoda tells Tremac to start using evasive uh, maneuvers, but uh, he, he panics, and then the ship gets uh, shot down, blown up, or whatever. Um, which is the part I was kind of confused about, because they don't mention what happened to Yoda uh, afterwards. Um, so yeah, it was, it was honestly a little confusing. Uh, but then we see uh, Mark Yonroe and Crix arrive on uh, Varant Tarnum. Uh, finding the uh, missing piece to the uh, artifact, uh, which I assume that's where uh, Yoda and Tromac were heading. Uh, but uh, then, you know, Marky you know, talks to uh, Crix, telling him that he needs someone to run a, a Nile outpost when he's putting on Varant Tarnum. And, you know, he uh, gives uh, Crix his helmet uh, and, you know, takes it off when we actually see uh, Marky on Rose's face. Um, but uh, while that was going on, we see uh, Zine talking to uh, Lula and Master uh, Kantum Sai, you know, telling her that, you know, they're going to train her in the ways of the Force, but uh, not become a full Jedi. And uh, they also ask her to uh, help with uh, the Nihil, uh, which the issue ends with both Crix and Zine getting asked uh, by their respective uh, groups, uh, you know, Mark Yonro, Crix, and uh, Lula, Master can't them, uh, Sai was in, you know, if they'll, uh, you know, join them, uh, which, you know, then they both respond with, of course. And that's where the issue ends. So, yeah, um, I, like I said, I, I thought it was a solid issue. I liked where, uh, Crix and Zine ended off. I'm excited to see how, uh, their stories will, uh, continue and whatnot. I'm, I'm happy, you know, this, you know, they didn't join each other. Right away, I like that. You know, they seem like characters who will be a bigger part of the ongoing higher public story. Um, so yeah, and you know, we know that uh, some of the characters will be appearing in a race to crash what tower and obviously in later adventure issues. So yeah, but um, yeah, uh, and you know, I'm also a little bit happy about that because I, I do like in the comic. With uh, the art paneling when they're cutting in between um their respective uh stories their point of views uh definitely at the end of this issue I I, I like how it cuts uh, back and forth uh it's a uh, neat but um yeah so yeah we're really the only complaint I have is that Yoda the final thing with Yoda I was kind of kind of a little bit confused uh, about what. Uh, exactly happened there, um, but uh, mainly because I didn't explain it afterwards. Uh, obviously, it could be something that's explained in the next issue or 
another story, but um, yeah, uh, I guess also I, I do wish we would have gone Crix and Zine maybe talking a little bit more uh, to each other than just a couple words, uh, but you know, other than that, I thought it was a solid issue, so yeah, but uh, my grade, I'll give it a B, so yeah, anyways, uh, the next High Republic uh, story is The High Republic, The Rising Storm, the, the next the adult novel. So I'll be doing a uh, review of that uh, when that comes out on June 29th, around the, probably not on that day, but um, I might have a, I might do a first thoughts video uh, first and then do a full review once I finish the uh, novel. Uh, so yeah, but um, in the meantime, you can check out my reviews of all, uh, you know, all the other higher public stories, I've done reviews of every single one, uh, so from all the comics, short stories, and uh, novels, um, not so yeah. But anyways, I've been sorry. You know, catch you guys in the next one.